guys a little update from our first volunteering experience um, the first days were okay but as the day passed like the things got worse with the, the host like she really treated us like her employees and like she was never with us she just gave us orders via voice message and so we really weren't fail felt good and and so yeah we did we have decided to get out to leave her because we were feeling really bad well normally it goes really well i already did two work away in the netherlands and in sweden and it was amazing and uh, it is amazing guys i really encourage you to do walk away but unfortunately we had uh, just a bad experience but otherwise it's almost always great and uh, yeah but sometimes it can happen you can never know so you can have a bad experience wherever you are wherever you are sorry so yeah basically we're on the road again and we are really in the east countryside of Croatia and uh, let's hope we'll find a car to go to the nearest city Good to be on the road again. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, we have already uh, taken three cars today. In three hours. In three so... hours, which is really great. Yeah. And, um, but hopefully we find a car because here we are in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> the highway this way. And uh, yeah. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Patience is key. Yeah. Hey guys, I thought that I will take you with me today on a day in my life. Um, so we left the dog hotel yesterday, and now we we are in Slavonski Brod. It's in Croatia. It's like 100 kilometers from where we were at the dog hotel. So we now now we're heading down to the coast of Croatia. And uh, we slept at uh, like a kind of Airbnb. And so it's it's 9 a.m. We usually wake up around, depends on what we need to do to the day, it's usually 7 or 8 in the morning. We do some tea. Axel drinks tea too. I take my vitamin B12. I read my last night notes. Um, and I'm doing my, my Spanish lesson because I was learning Spanish and Swedish with uh, the, app, the app Babel. But since we are traveling, I just didn't took the time. And now we have a little time, so I'm doing just one Spanish lesson. La compañía de teatro. La compañía de teatro. Me gustan los pisos céntricos. Me gustan los pisos céntricos. Decide cómo quieres tu casa. Decide cómo quieres tu casa. Tu casa. Ya lo puedo ya. Un piso en alquiler. How tea is apple and cinnamon. Axel chose it. Wonderful. Yeah, wonderful. If you're sad, just drink it. If you what? If you're sad. Ah, if you're sad, yeah. Oh, a bad mood. Just drink it. Yeah. I recently learned that Oreo biscuits were vegan. 
blows my mind. It is quite chilly today, so I have one um, I have one merino top, and then my long sleeve merino top, and my other my second T-shirt that I put. So I have three um, layers, and um, I need to wash my hair tonight. It's getting dirty. I'm just going to write hot destination. And every morning, like we, we not always have a goal. Like for example, today we don't know exactly where we're going. I want to go to the coast, of course, but uh, which city I don't know. Um, I'm waiting for Axel so we can decide together. It's time to make our bag and leave this place and get on the road again. Ah uh, yes, in the summer it must be perfect! Yeah. <laughs> wow! It's the end of the day. Ah. Ah. <laughs> we made it! Today we just... We just... Traversé. We just... Across the whole country of yeah. Croatia in five hours drive. We are in the west coast of Croatia. And it's near wonderful. the sea. And look at this. It's so pretty. It's a better way to finish the day. Drinking tea is really one of my night routines. Like not, it's not really tea, but it's like herbal tea infusion. Mm -hmm. Louise, just make it your own day. Like writing down my thoughts of the day, what I want to learn what I want to improve about myself and reading. Uh, if you know me from previous videos, you may know that I absolutely love to read. I read at least one book per week and a little bit traveling. I didn't take any book, but I found this book in a, like it's a place in Europe. It, it does that like it's a box where people put um, free books for strangers and I took this one it's Charlotte Bronte Jane Eyre I don't know if I pronounce it correctly but I, I just started and I love it already my nice routine is really settle it down uh, Axel is in the living room um, we try sometimes to just have like how alone time because it's uh, essential we spend like every day all of our days together and it's important to when we are in a airbnb or a hotel like this to have like our alone time just is doing like he's watching his youtube videos and games and whatever and I'm doing my things and it feels really good to yeah to find this 
to find our home sanctuary inside us. I'm going to finish my tea and uh, read a little bit and then go to bed at 10. Okay, good night guys. <laughs>
and his accent i i know that i have quite um i have a few followers from united kingdom and hello guys hello to you but like i haven't i've never heard such an accent like the the welsh the accents from the accent english accent from the people who lives in wales in the united kingdom it is insane i i think that it's like the most beautiful accent i've never i've ever heard that was insane i i've loved this guy was maybe 60 years old and i loved talking with him i was in the front seat next to him and we talked for maybe 45 minutes together and Axel was in the back and we talked about traveling, about the political situations in the US, in the UK, in France. Um, we talked about so many interesting topics and um, again I just loved his accent and Axel told me that I was speaking my English was way better than when I was speaking with another with another English person because I yeah when I speak with a pe with people from the UK which is which has never happened in my entire life yet so I hope to 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 go to the UK one day and speak directly with the people because my accent when I'm with a ah I'm going to get to the point. <laughs> um, yes, when I'm speaking with a person from the UK, my English is way better. And I don't know why. That's really strange because even just talking to my phone, as I do now, my English is really not good. And when I was speaking with this man, I did zero, zero mistake. I, my words were just flowing and flowing. And it was really easy to speak English. And, with the, the good accent and etc etc so yeah it was really fun really cool um i just love it hiking for for meeting people like that like that's insane like in real life this guy we've never met we've we will never have talked because he was a formal businessman and i don't talk to businessmen in a day-to-day -day basis so yeah, each hiking is full of magic, full of surprises every time. Um, yeah, just random thought of the night. So, so cool. I put my yojoba oil. Um, I don't have a lot, but I don't know why. This is not really working. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm gonna call my family now and I will film what Axel is going to make us for dinner tonight because yeah, Axel always cook for us because he's a really great cook and I'm not so he's going to cook tonight and it's going to be delicious as always. And we have a terrace too. Wow. It's wonderful. Golden arrow. Good hair day. So the telecamera is so good. She wants to show you is her. Her hair. I just woke up from my afternoon nap because I love being a grandma already. Just had my afternoon tea and now 
I'm gonna put the videos of the GoPro on my phone to start edit the video of next week. So let's do that. I'm really, really bad with technology. That's why I film on my phone. That's why I edit on my phone because I just can't stand editing on a laptop because that's just too hard for me. But maybe one day, I don't know, I took classes for editing because I'm, I'm really bad at it. That's ridiculous. But um, yeah, maybe one day I'm going to learn to do more editing stuff. But for now, let's be real. I just film with this little bad boy and that, that is making great shots. So I'm pretty happy with it. Let's do that. Hi guys, I'm at the cafe right now editing this video and I just, real I just realized that I haven't filmed um, a conclusion to this vlog so here I am doing it um, just before uploading this video, sorry. <laughs> um, well, I hope you liked it, thank you so much for watching and next week it will be a chit chat video. I will not reveal the subject right now, but it will talk about minimalism and I can't wait because I've been doing some vlogs since I've been traveling, but next week is chit chat video, so you're gonna like it. Thank you so much and 